Good morning students. Welcome to class 8. Today we are going to discuss about rational numbers for class 8. Rational number janne ke liye hume sabse pehle natural numbers pata honne chahiye. What are natural numbers? Natural numbers are counting numbers. For example, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 up to infinity are called natural numbers. Then whole numbers. What are whole numbers? Counting numbers and zero are whole numbers. Now what are rational numbers? For example, P by Q is a rational number where Q is not equal to 0. 1 by 2 is a rational number. 3 by 4 is a rational number. Now, we will talk about additive inverse and multiplicative inverse. Additive inverse If we find the additive inverse of 1 by 2 then we will write minus 1 by 2 minus 2 by 3 then additive inverse of minus 2 by 3 is 2 by 3. It means 0 is the additive identity. Because 1 by 2 plus minus 1 by 2 is equal to 0. It means a plus minus a. 0. That's why 0 is called the additive identity. Now, multiplicative inverse. Multiplicative inverse The reciprocal of the number is called multiplicative inverse. For example, the multiplicative inverse of 2, the reciprocal of 2 is 1 by 2. It means multiplicative inverse of 2 is also 1 by 2. Minus 13. Multiplicative inverse of minus 13 is 1 by minus 13. If the number is minus 6 by minus 7, then, then multiplicative inverse of minus 6 by minus 7, then it is equal to 6 by 7. Okay? Then, Multiplicative inverse of 6 by 7 is 7 by 6. Now we will discuss about some properties of rational numbers. First of all, we will discuss about commutative property. Then we will say 1 by 2 plus 3 by 4 
is equal to 3 by 4 plus 1 by 2. This is called commutative property. Is distributive property. A is common. A is common, B is left, and plus here A is common and C is left. This is distributive property. Now we will use these properties in some questions. First of all, minus 2 by 3. Multiply 3 by 5 plus 5 by 2 minus 3 by 5 multiply 1 by 6. Using these properties in this question, first of all, in this expression, this is A and this is B. plus B. In commutative property, A plus B is equal to B plus C. We will write it like this. Minus 2 by 3 multiply 3 by 5 minus 3 by 5 multiply 1 by 6 plus 5 by 2 by using commutative property. is common. Now we will use distributive property. 3 by 5 is common. Minus 2 by 3 minus 1 by 6 because 3 by 5 is common not minus 3 by 5 is common. By using distributive property. Now we will solve this by using LCM. LCM of 3 and 6 is 6. Now we will solve it 3 2's are and 2 2's are 4. 6 1's are and 1 1's are 1. It means 3 by 5 multiply minus 5 by 6. Plus 5 by 2. 3 1s are 3 2s are. 5 1s are 5 1s. It means minus 1 by 2 plus 5 by 2. We will solve it again by using LCM. 2. LCM of 2 and 2 is 2. Minus 1 plus 5. That is 4 by 2, 2 twos are 4, 2 is the answer. I will repeat it. Commutative property is A plus B is equal to B plus C. We will use it. 5 by 2 is A and minus 3 by 5 multiply 1 by 6 is B. We will write it A plus B, yani B plus A, minus 3 by 5, multiply 1 by 6, and 5 by 2 is here. Then 3 by 5 is common. We will use distributive property here. Then we will solve it like this. Answer is 2. Now, here are some questions. For your homework. First question is write additive inverse of eight 
second is minus 1 by 5, third is minus 6, fourth is minus 2 by minus 9 and fifth is 1 by 5. Second question, write multiplicative inverse of 2, 1 by 8, minus 12, minus 9 by minus 10, and 7 by 9. Third question is 0 0.3, the multiplicative inverse, is by using properties find 2 by 5 multiply minus 3 by 7 minus 1 by 6 multiply 3 by 2 plus 1 by 14 multiply 2 by 5 if there is any problem I will solve it stay at home stay healthy